What's up guys, it's the Carp here, back with another episode of Making America Great. And as you can see, we have won the Gold Cup again. If you missed the last episode, go check it out. I kind of explained uh, this new sort of format I'm going to be doing. Essentially, the only games I want to show you guys, uh, so, it's not, you know, so it doesn't get boring, is uh, the World Cup. Um, so that will be next episode, actually. But this year, 2025, these are our results. So, same as last year, absolutely flying. 13 games... Um, in 2025, only one draw. Unfortunately, it was against Mexico. It is uh, the second year in a row that we've drawn one game, you know, just one game shy of that perfect record. But really just incredible, um, especially the amount of goals we're scoring. I mean, 9-0 to Costa Rica. Uh, that's the second or third time we've scored nine goals in a match with the United States. Uh, and then a 4-0 thrashing of Mexico in the final. Um, <clears throat> can't see the top goal score anymore, but... Uh, you can assume it was Pepe. He uh, he got at least one hat trick along the way. Uh, unfortunately, he's injured right now. But actually, let's just go. Yeah, I will look through the entire um, entirety of the the Americans instead of just the squad. So if we look here, Pepe, um, if you, you've seen in every episode, just dominating 43 goals in 40 games now, just unbelievable return. Um, and as long as he can keep fit. Uh, only 22 years old, he, he's definitely hitting 100 goals. Speaking of 100, John Brooks, he's made his 100, 100th appearance, the first player to do so um, under my reign as a USA boss. Pulisic getting pretty close to that number, uh, 96, 50 goals scored, so a really decent return. Um, hasn't really improved that much. Uh, the main players that you know keep on improving are uh, McKinney here. Um, Tyler Adams, definitely a, a much better player than he was. Reyna, again, just world-class um, player at this point. And really, the United States is a, a pretty damn solid team um, at this point. Pretty much every player uh, in, the, you know, in the team that starts regularly is worth more than $20 million. Um, and Most of them are undervalued, to be honest. Um, Josh Harden dropped in value a little bit, but he's still got great stats. He's doing all right at PSG. Uh, Busio here, pretty much the same, same as Della Fuente. Um, <clears throat> Dest at this point, um, he's probably not going to improve any further. Really wish I could use him in my system, but there's just not, you know, he's pretty much the only outside back, uh, that's any good, um, you know, in, that's American. Uh, Storm getting pretty decent at this point. Yamosa, unfortunately, hasn't improved that much. Uh, Lisek here, um, a new player you probably haven't seen, only 20 years old. Really promising, really decent stats for that age. <clears throat> And a couple other players, you know, again, just really promising there. Uh, we've got some great uh, center backs coming through right now, actually. Uh, if we look at Fides here, really, really good stats. Um, he could turn into a great ball-playing uh, defender or just a great center back. Um, either one. Only thing really lacking hit for him is his stamina. Uh, unfortunately, I, I did call him up for the most recent friendlies, but he was injured. Um, then there's a couple other players. There is a, uh, within the squad... One guy that I want to take a look at here. Not Drew Pepe. Um, there he is. So Caleb Campbell, only 18 years old. He actually got a hat trick uh, in one of those friendlies. Now got four goals in seven appearances. Really, really good stats and seven or uh, 19 stamina uh, for him. So he's going to be hopefully really, really good player in the future. But uh, that's sort of what the squad is looking like. Um, if we now just look at the. Uh, rankings. Where are we at? And I'm not actually sure what the most recent ones are. We have dropped down to 10th place. Fantastic. So, I think we were on 1707 points, maybe, the last time uh, you guys would have seen. Um, now up to 1748, and uh, really we're we're pretty close uh, to really breaking into, you know, the top five. Uh, that's kind of the big, the big, like, um, you know, change in points is between 5th and 6th place. So hopefully we can get there soon. Uh, but like I said, the World Cup will be next episode. That's about uh, about all I want to look at here um, for this one. I think you guys are uh, pretty much caught up on uh, what's happened. Yet another Gold Cup under the, under the uh, you know, into the trophy cabinet. Um, but uh, if you guys are looking forward to the next one, if you like this one, leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you guys next time.